Hey everybody, it's the last Robokai, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Dishonored, the High Chaos Run. Uh, last time, we got started going back through some familiar territory in Bottle Street, only this time, uh, we worked with Sakjo, the uh, fellow who we poisoned the stills of last time. Uh, he had apparently had a few openings uh, on account of a lot of his dudes dying of plague for some really strange reason, so we, uh, we pretty much retread a lot of areas that we'd already been in the game. And now that we've done that, and now that we've realized someone's out to kill Slackjaw, we're off to the Golden Cat, where we have uh, two major objectives and one optional objective. And joining me on this journey are... Uh, Yo, it's Cool Guy here, and uh, I, I'm i looking forward to this. I've only ever, do ever done the Golden Cat, like, quiet and prof uh, professional, so I imagine this is just, uh, just going to be... This is just go uh, going to be become, like, a charnel house. And I'm Orv, and I'm expecting more bottles thrown, more bodies thrown off ledges, or I'm going to be filing a formal complaint. <laughs> With well, hope. There's, there's, <laughs> well, you might as well start filling out the paperwork, because um, this episode, it's going to be all about killing prostitutes. <laughs> uh, so I can't, with, I can't <laughs> not, support not really. this. <laughs> Already dead inside, uh, etc. Yeah, no, it's, it's fine. Everything's fine. Ignore the sword, and let's uh let's head on in. And we resume where we left it off last time, leaving Slackjaw's house of fun and things, and getting advice on what not to eat. <laughs> kiss a kiss a bucket. You know what? I, I, I've used I've used the entire holy buckets exclamation before because you know homonyms or yeah, ho or so, I'm sorry, homophones. Is, but. Sick as a bucket. Uh, that's one I've never heard. Well, this really confused me because I'm like, was there a hole in this roof at one point? Like, did he, did he, did he patch it all up? Am I, am I in the wrong room? I'm confused. Uh, that that door, that door in the back used to be open. Ah, oh, there we go. So that's why I'm, that's why I'm slowly going insane. Yeah, no, that that used to be open, and you you can get like a you can get a bone charm and seventy five coins or so in there on uh, on the last mission. Must have so been hey, nothing. Remember, remember here, and remember all the fun times we had in here before, where I kicked a dude into a bush. Let's have some more fun. I was gonna say, I mean, don't 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 tell me he's still there. I mean, seriously, that's like ser that's like. Not even the most basic respect for the dead here. Oh! <laughs> that was an interesting sound. That's a fight. This district is now under a mandatory... Yeah, Blink does slow down the time a little, so... Whoa! Corvo, calm down! Off at the knees. <laughs> yeah. Dishonored combat tip. If you want to kill people real fast, cut, them, cut their legs off. <laughs> I want to kill anybody real and fast. And to answer your question, yep, he's still there. Jesus Christ. <laughs> there were like four guys going around there. You can't even pull him out of the shrubbery. They're not sure how much of him has become the shrubbery and how much is still him. Um, all I know is that the knights who say me are very, uh, very disappointed in this development. I, I also want to say, like... This... the We don't get any Wall of Light shenanigans again because the game tricks me. Um, they, in the previous run through, the wall of light controls were on the other side of the wall. This time they're on this side of the wall, and I don't realize <laughs> that until I get to the other side. This is a punishable offense. And, uh, Here, you, you're <laughs> even copying with the my room like, over there now. Come on, come on. Yeah, well, there's a very good reason to take your route, and, uh, we'll see it once I get over the top. You know, once I stop, like, wondering why I can't make this work. There you go. Yeah. yeah. Geometry in this game. Can sometimes be very fiddly. I I, re I really do appreciate that that they have the indicator that yeah you'll pull uh, you'll pull yourself up over here though. Oh yeah, that's like the best thing. And yeah, here's another one of these. Didn't get a really good show off of uh, of how like how this thing murderizes people. So I'm just gonna sit on the little little platform here on the left and uh, we just watch it laser. You know, <laughs> little red laser guided seeking torpedo death <laughs> as these guys run around confused. They're really not grasping the core concept of this. <laughs> I love how these guys are getting are getting hit and stumbling, but not dying. There's a guy in the corner over there. He's just like face first in the corner, wondering what's going on. When I find you, automated automated machine death turret, it's gonna be bad. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> because I will die. 
Oh my gosh. So I'm just checking to make sure I'm not going to be going past any bone charms. The one down there will get on our way out. And the other one will get on our way into the hotel. Because that was one of our rewards from, uh, from Slack. Yep, rats. Also rats. <laughs> they do not, they do not waste any time. It's just, see, look, all this, all the wiring and everything is on the other side now. It's just like, seriously? Should, you should have, oh, should have yeah. shot the, the, the spare, uh, whale oil things just to see what happened. I gotta do that sometime. I haven't really done much exploding whale oil. Anyone with information for It's highly volatile. You filthy mudlark. Better a tramp like you get a leg, sir. We've been on half rations for a week. I ain't catching the plague. Hand it over. No, please, it's for my baby. He needs it. It's us that need it. Approved. I need it. Wow! <laughs> no, it's me that needs it. Also, sorry about your baby that's probably going to die now. So all of that just happened. <laughs> yep. But hey, on the bright side, you know, free elixir. Oh, okay. I'm sitting here thinking, did the other two incinerate? And I was like, yes, that's totally. They a didn't power know I was has. there, so they exploded. <laughs> they exploded into ash. Always remember, if you don't see the body, it's because I took took an ability that you know is just gonna keep the clutter down a I little. I always for I always forget that that uh, that that applies to ranged kills. Cause I mean that's not something that follows for me. Yeah, you you are you are wholesale murdering. You're trying to like dump unconscious bodies when you can. Even I was impressed by the cool display there. And it it takes a lot to uh, to affect your cold and shriveled heart. <laughs> yep, there we go. Captain's chair hotel. Obviously, we can't go back to see the overseers because, as a result of uh, everything that went on there, uh, they don't, they're not letting anybody in. The doors are barred. Fuck all of they're, that. They're trying to sort themselves out. They're trying to decide on a who on like a new high overseer. White the election smoke. process is a little bit like the Pope election. It's actually not. I already made the white smoke joke. I'm sorry. Oh. Oh my god. One of the most worthless things. Well, I don't know about that because I will eat food before I ever use an elixir. So it's actually really fantastic for me. It, the thing is, is that there's enough food around, around that if you're just chowing down on everything, like, you know, you should. I was being really cautious here because uh, I was confusing this with a later mission where there is a building that you can go up to to get to the roof of somewhere uh, that has a not insignificant number of weepers in it. And I'm like, wait, where? Oh, okay. And seeing your thought processes on display never stops bringing me joy. There's always this is moment of realization where you can almost hear the disappointed sigh. I, I, I can almost hear the... <laughs> Of you scratching your head. Oh, there's, got, there's got to be a little bit of head scratching here. I'm not proud of the moment, but I'll, uh, I'll be happy to shove it off. So, this is really like, this is the game. It's basically saying, have fun. There are so many ways to get inside the golden cat from here. You can just waltz in the front door. You can mo move across the rooftops here, too. As you can see, there's like an open window on the third floor. Uh, you can... You can sneak in through a side door as well that, that the game has. There's just a lot of different ways to get through, and I'm taking an even different course to that one. Oh god. <laughs> For a minute there, I thought you were just gonna fall down and crater. I, 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 I noticed just as I was teleporting what was happening, so I made sure not to, uh, not to press forward when that happened. Otherwise, I, that would have, uh, that would have been a reload. I, I cannot tell you how many times I have done that to myself. It's like, you would... You would, th you would think the, that I was just suicidal and not absolutely frickin' terrified of heights the way I am. Seven infant farming villages, bastard daughters, and the extra mouths that can be fed. Just so you know, like, um, you feel even like worse when, when I eventually stab some of them. Okay. Wind, I'm done. Done. <laughs> <laughs> High places and wind. Not my thing. Gonna uh, take care of the guards out the front. Oh, that's how fast you swing with like the the whirlwind. 
Man, that, you can get some mm. really good chops off on people. Yeah, that last fatality is all, always the one that hit, that hits me most viscerally because it like Corvo just sort of nonchalantly stabs him in the throat, and it's just like, holy <laughs> Jesus! Oh yeah, he's like not for nothing. He's probably handled a few attempts on the Empress's life beforehand. Oh yeah, no, you no, know, no, no. The only reason he the only reason he lost this time is because of weird outsider hoodoo magic. He, uh, Corvo's a tor uh, like a bona fide badass. There's no two ways about that. But <laughs> hey, look, they got they got my face right. Amusingly enough, they still don't know it's me. Me. <laughs> they know amusingly it's enough, somebody. If you, if you ghost, uh, if you ghost the level, the wanted mm. posters that uh, that show up for uh, for your for your exploit on that level will instead say an unknown criminal. And just it'll just yeah. be that'd be like a uh, hey sup. That's pretty cool. Guess who? Guess who forgot to sneak? Oh well. Yeah. So she just alerted everybody in the building, mm -hmm. um, but they don't actually it. know where I am or where she was. So welcome to Achievement Hunter. I'm going to show you guys how to get the Escapist achievement really easily. Just do that, <laughs> and after a few minutes, they'll give up. The entirety what? of the the building will give up, and that's more than five people. And that's how you get the Escapist achievement. This is my not-so-great moment, because I'm like, okay, I'm going to use the possession power to sneak in. I'm not going to realize that I need to, like, use a potion to do it. I'm like, why is it not working? I'm triggered. Is there any fish down here? Yeah, there's fish down here. Of course, that's used up even more magical power. <laughs> I have no wow, excuse dude. for this either. I was, I was perfectly awake and perfectly yeah. sober. This is just... I'm like, am I, am I doing this right? <laughs> this is... This is a complete failure of the thought you process. Figure but we're, we're you don't figure it out. Oh no, I figured it out. Don't worry. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> you can almost hear wait the light minute. bulb coming on. There you go. I got the escapist. <laughs> I got the achievement. Oh my I left gosh. That in there. Okay. Oh my so gosh. firstly, I accidentally used the wrong power. <laughs> God damn it! There we go. All there right. We go. Now we are uh, murder fish. And so this is. This is how you go. You get inside of a hagfish, and you can just enter the building this way. And you come up in the uh, in the basement where all the uh, prostitutes go and uh, wash away the horribleness of their existences <laughs> in a shower. The Pendletons are here again, rich and mostly clean. Can't ask for more than that. But they're drunks. I can't stand that. It doesn't matter though. Morgan took the ivory room with Lulia. Well, then. Custis is up in the smoking room with Violetta. Bunting's the only one left. Oh, no, not tonight. He's crazy. And I have to use that thing on him. Ugh. Oh, he's not the worst. He's blindfolded anyway. Just shock him and leave. You don't even have to touch him. Don't worry, I won't. Well, that was gross with a capital J. Yeah, we're, uh... We're, we're you know... This is this is not a happy fun like theme park to work at. Let's just say that much. I don't think there's been a brothel in the history of history that could be described as a happy fun theme park. Well, you know, brothel land. <laughs> so where that, I'm just imagining that was part of the carnival of lust in uh, the Renaissance era or something like that. Hey, what, hey, have you ever played that one mission in Assassin's Creed uh, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood? I have not. Oh, uh, well, you didn't get to see, like, a mostly naked priest in, like, a, a loincloth then. You missed out. Um, I'm, go I'm gonna go to my grave happy that I missed that. <laughs> no, you, you missed out. <laughs> it was something. That is, that is a pretty amazing sequence. Like, it just, your, your eyes pop out of your skull when you see that. I love Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, by the way. <laughs> Assassin's Creed game. Yeah, so, yeah, so everyone's kind of gotten back to normal for the most part regarding that. Golden Cat's a really nice place once I take the uh, the weed filter off. It's, the game gives you, like, a million ways you can tell where, where the Pendletons are, which is nice. Um, listening to conversations, looking at signs, looking at other things. Yeah, you see, we've got, like, about five notes of it saying exactly the same thing. You have, you have to presu the presume that... Everybody is just going to kill uh, to kill hookers the first time they see them. Nice. Apparently, that that's that was a thing in the design meetings. Yeah, 
apparently the uh, the soldiers are uh, taking advantage of the place a bit too much, so... You know, they're in a little bit of trouble with the madam. And the madam's an important character if you want to get the keys. Because the keys unlock a lot of things in this place. Including her own office. <laughs> Bunker around outside for a little bit as well, because I'm... Yeah, some... Someone's someone's still patrolling for us, but I think he's the only person because he's the only person that says anything about it. But uh, they that one that one um, person I alerted everybody with, uh, unfortunately, is going to be what sort of stops this being a stealth run. I was going to say it now. Yeah, I was going I was going to say I uh, I think we I think we already got through with stealth. I like how those uh, those other those other two guards are just sort of staring at each other with their swords out. It's like they're measuring them or something. They're they're waiting for me to come close enough to trigger their conversation. <laughs> and they're just like, "Where is he? Oh my god! I can't work with these amateurs." <laughs> Craft services table closes at nine. Yeah, you totally just turned away from a dude who was about to spot you. Whatever. I do this. But I do that a lot. Like, I did it. Remember the first time I went to Galvani's? I just kind of wandered into a room. Once I'd wandered around a table, looked back, and was like, oh, yeah, right. Hey <laughs> There's a guy guys. in here. There's a guy and stabbed him in the face. He didn't even notice me. All right, so everybody who's outside is dead. Literally, everybody who's outside is dead. Well, it's much quieter now, at any rate. Yeah, no one's walking around going, we got a, we got a spooky person about. So let's let's sneak back in. I I really I have no plan going into this. I made a point of having no plan when I went into this. You know, I cool guys routing everything to be the most efficient. I'm just sort of stumbling through here trying to figure out the best way to kill everybody in the moment. On it, I wouldn't have it any other way. Honestly, you know, I mean, this this is ser this is seriously the sort of, the sort of thing that I'm just going to sit back with a beer with and just be like, yeah, that's that's another throat. I too hate throats. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I'm just, you know, I'm systematically... No, no, some dad's still walking around saying, look out, we got a prowler. Those guys are seriously just like, hey, let's let, let's check out each other's swords. That has no subtext at all. So they're in the other room. I really like the design of the golden cat. It's like, everywhere else is so disheveled and busted up. But this place has... This place has, has really got the sense of, like, they're trying to, like, keep the place running as a... as it's intended. Yeah, the, the madam is working really, really hard to, uh, to keep things going, even though that's kind of futile, futile. Okay, well, we've got two... Clearly we can see two girls making out via, via superpower vision, but the, the problem here is actually... One of the prostitutes has gone into a position there, prone, which basically means that um, she's still convinced someone out there is trying to kill everybody, and the moment I walk into this room... Dunstan, the Pendleton's... Yeah, everybody's... Well... Well... And... Assassin! Help! No, no, no! Someone's trying to kill me, and it just gets... Did he seriously miss a pistol shot from three feet away? While he was turned I, away, I yeah. live a charmed life. I don't even have that one that makes, makes people miss their shots yet. Oh, nice parry! Come on, fight me. fight me. Fight me. Fight me. Fight me, IRL. <laughs> Okay. Yep, that's cool. You can hear there's this, there's something in there. Oh please! Don't no. And the the prostitutes here uh, here are better are better alarms than like anything that guard tower was doing. The <laughs> captain. And yeah, now like even more people are coming. I don't even realize there are this many people in this place. Wow! Did he just punk his yep. soldier in the back of the yep. head? Also, dead Pendleton. Okay, why not? Blink and you'll miss it. Alright, anybody else? Anybody else? Shut up! <laughs> you only get stabbed if you call out for help. This is the rule. You only get stabbed if you call out for help. It's it's a pity that Corvo's mute, cause uh, so he can't just like be sh be yelling at people. Stay the fuck. See, down! this guy's not calling out for help. He doesn't die. Why is no one making the rounds over here? Ah, well, you know, there's a funny story about that. Yeah, look at this guy. This is what we were talking about with the captains. Look at this guy. Damn, yeah, this is fuck crazy around. good. Dude, that guy was Muhammad Ali-like. He was floating like a butterfly, and then he kicked your ass like a bee. And then, you know, his head came off. 
<laughs> Priorities. <laughs> gotta, gotta get that dollar. Gotta get the paper. Meet your maker. Something, something, Undertaker. I, I, it's been a long time since I played Mad World. Yeah, well, they're so being nice. Ivory room. Here we go. Oh, the, Let's have some fun God. with the artist. Finally. I've been like this for 20 minutes. Your footsteps sound a little loud. Have you gained a little weight, honey? Wow. Not just like last time, understand? Slowly. I'm only triggered the shock at my command. Get it? And the safe word tonight will be retribution. Those diodes. You hear that? You stop. One shock out of line, and you are out of a job. I can tell you love your work. I'm just gonna get all the dialogue out of him because it's funny. Oh, 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 that's good. I deserve that one. Shall I tell you why? The Pendletons are here, right? I'll start with them. I cheated them. Robbed them of thousands. Careful. I have a condition. <laughs> the condition is you're a I fucking weirdo. It. Stick to the script, please. <laughs> oh, you're ruthless. Don't hold back. I'll tell you everything. The Pendleton's inheritance was worth hundreds of thousands at least. I told them it was junk. Of course you did. Retribution! Retribution! Oh, that was perfect. But it's all I can take for tonight. Call my servants. We're done. Yeah, not nah. even. Holy. <laughs> I didn't even pause on that I one. Said, retribution! Now let me out! <laughs> Character is busy being electrocuted. What the? Who is this? What do you want? Nothing. Very simple safe. question. Yes, of course. The combination is one, three, eight. Take anything you find. I think I felt my heart skip. And now we've got what we want, we're just gonna keep electrocuting. <laughs> <laughs> Please, my heart won't take this. Ask me anything. I screwed the Pendletons, yes. And, and I've been to the Brimsleys. They worship the outsider. I've seen it. I did it too. Me too. We should be friends. Except you're unconscious. Please tell me you kill him. No, no. Uh, I, I was wondering if we'd get to electrocute him and kill him, but no, he's just unconscious. Just. There's not going to be too many people left to get him anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah, I imagine he's going to walk out of here, and he's going to be the one that has to live with it. Okay, you know what? I, I'm, I'm okay with this again. I even try avoided walking directly in front of that girl, so I didn't have to have to stab her in the face. Well, you're you can't say I that you're not trying. almost have a soul. Oh no, you had you had it right. Oh no 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 no. How long is this going to go on? My men should have found him by now. Could it be a false alarm? I'm not leaving until everything's quiet. I'm a Pendleton. People envy us, you know. Our fortune, our votes, our good luck. Good luck. In what? some ways, nobility yeah. is a burden I bear. Yes. Our my intelligences. Boy. I'm not paying for your time, by the way. Not if we're just going to. Sit I fucking love that line. <laughs> I'm not paying for this. All right. Well, let's uh, let's go get ourselves a pen. <laughs> good night, sweet prince. You're not necessary for the plan. I'm sorry. All right. Please do not ever ask for credit. I love that. I have to hang that on the wall. That's... <laughs> so there is one more room we haven't explored yet. Oh, this is several. fantastic. The, uh, the steam room. Now, like, one of the Pendleton's can actually start down here. Where they are is never the same with, uh, with each run. Like, it's varied somewhat. So... There are, um... There is a room in here. And I figured if it was empty, I was gonna throw him in it. Uh, but it's it's busy. How did you know do that? Most of the women here were farm girls whose parents wow. sold them to the madam. I trained in the school at Samara, the finest in the world. I trained in a great many things. Morgan and Custis are gonna take hours. They always do. Tell me then, how can I satisfy you? Could you? 
Well, there's a part of me what? That <laughs> that subtitle. There was a hound. You're not the only one this happens to. They never explicitly say what that part is, though, so it could just be his foot. Hashtag yeah, you know. just brothel, brothel things. Just brothel things. Okay, so oh we need we God. need the key, and that means we're gonna go up and need to pay a visit to the uh, to the madam in her office. Hey, you guys! That's Henny, because it lets us pick there. up a few things along the way. Yeah, just hanging from the wall. No one cares. To be fair, that was, that was how you got one uh, one of them in the high overseer's place too. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I just hanging from the wall. Aristocrat. Yeah, I can't. I can't. I can't ruin that guy's life. I, I would be very temp uh, tempted to pick up the uh, the aristocrat and then just like put him on a very high roof or something like that. Just <laughs> just so just so cute. when he wakes up, he's like, "What in the fuck was I doing?" So apparently, the madam has not heard all of the insanity that's been going on inside of her own brothel. But that's okay because she's been culpable in the kidnapping of the empress's daughter, so she's done. Good night. See, the boldest measures, measures are always the safest. They are for the, uh, they are for uh, for this place anyway. The before any, anybody feels even remotely bad, uh, re yeah, even remotely bad for her. The uh, there there's a bunch there's a bunch of like little hints around around the the golden cat, which I'm not sure if you pick up or not. But uh, it it uh, it very much impl implies that the new madam like beats her uh, her staff and stuff like that. Well, she accepts she accepts slaves essentially. Uh, she's got indentured servants. Okay, so um, <laughs> if the Pendleton were in here in the uh, in the room which is currently occupied by the uh, the soldier with the sword hand and the lady helping him, um, you could do this to kill him, and there's an achievement for it. I didn't want to interrupt the animation though. I wasn't going to go in there and render everybody unconscious. I wanted to show everybody what happens. What that noise? Oh no. Good God! It's very bullshit. Because they didn't see me, they both evaporate into ash. <laughs> <laughs> Holy sleep. Christ, man! So, alright. And I'm like, well, okay. So, I couldn't show that off. I wonder if it'll work again. It doesn't, uh, sadly. But, you know. Well, there's money. You can't blame me for you can't blame me for uh, for hoping. Oh He's God! You just that I could just stuff him in here and gas him again. Unfortunately, not. I haven't routed the uh, the bro uh, the brothel yet, and you just pointed out to me that if I get unlucky, I'm gonna have to go. Uh, I'm not going to have to route into that room just to get that guy's cash. Mm-hmm. Oh, there are hagfish in the pool. That's gotta be oh, some well. fetish. Well. We've run out pretty much run out of creative ways to kill this guy, so uh There we go. Instant drowning effect for <laughs> it. He didn't know you were the Wow. He <laughs> disintegrated with sense. Evaporate on contact with water. He must he That's must the be drowning the effect in this game that we're talking about. Uh, People drown instantly in this game. Like they breathe through every pore of their <laughs> butts. <laughs> Someone needs but. a chiropractor. <laughs> Wow. Dude, did this just turn into viscera cleanup detail? <laughs> hey, look, he looks like he's sleeping. <laughs> I suppose at, le at least he's not late. <laughs> not gonna. Oh, man. <laughs> Hold on. I need to check something. Okay, the rune's up there. You're That's good. Oh, my God. You're seriously going to have that in your hands when you go up and greet Emily, aren't you? No, uh, no, not at all. I'm not gonna have it in my hand when I go to Emily. Where to Christ, from guy. <laughs> <laughs> Absolute promise I will not have a severed head in my arms when I go see Emily. <laughs> the crunching noise! Oh, I can't get over that. Okay, so, so this one is actually what I've been doing regardless. Um, <laughs> apparently people just can't hit me with bullets. That's, that, that's your natural luck, man. <laughs> I'm just unnerving everybody naturally, so it's all good. Reasons Robokai plays Blood Bowl. <laughs> So that was a, a crust the coin. Pearl. If everyone was mentioning okay, you shouldn't eat a river crust, that might just be because they've got a pearl inside of them that's larger than your head. I, I would be okay with finding with finding a pearl that big. His mustache parallaxes really oddly. Oh my god! You're going to, yeah. 
What was that? I need help. Okay, sorry, you scream for help. There really need there needs to be a uh, press F to shout thing. Yeah, so there's the there's the thing about the missing women uh, being sent there as well. Yeah. This place is terrible. It's almost as terrible as I am as a human being. <laughs> So yeah, we've got quite a lot of access to a lot of powers at the moment. And I do consider getting Wind Blast, because that's pretty fun for uh, for killing people, but we'll leave that till later as well. It's really sad that the that level one can't KO people. Yeah. What are you doing? I don't trust what? you anymore here. <laughs> you don't trust me anymore? Me? <laughs> I, Corpo, I, don't, I don't trust you. Bodyguard to the Empress wholesome. only ever failed once. I don't. I, yeah, I just don't trust that you're doing anything wholesome. That's for goddamn sure. Oh jeez. Well, there really is nobody else left in our past. All we got to do is go see Emily. Uh, as good as my word, I'm not carrying a seven. <laughs> <laughs> Show you a head chopped off if you want. <laughs> that seems like a long time ago. Did you seriously go, hey kid, you want to see a dead body? Dead. No, we can leave. Well, I don't have to ask her that. I brought one in with me. There's a special door to come and go for special people, and I'll show you. And if anyone tries to stop us, you can fight. Them. I wouldn't have to worry about that, Emily. <laughs> pretty, pretty but a special sure there door for special no people, life. and there's no one more special than us. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's no life that exists in this place anymore. I'm sure she's grown up really quickly over the last couple weeks, but she's just like, yeah, you can just kill people if they're a problem. Go for it. <laughs> so she's really fast. Holy How's your shit. vertigo, cool guy? <laughs> uh, there's no wind, so I'm okay. <laughs> okay for now. <laughs> right, is it... there, I, I can't play certain parts of Dying Light just because just because my vertigo gets the so bad. Locked. Unlock it so we can get away from this place. This place is on the river, so you must have come by boat. I'll wait for you near the boat. I remember the way. Don't worry about me. So, we don't have to escort her, thankfully. That's all of our objectives completed. She just sort of, uh, she just sort of disappears there, whatever. Yeah, it's like, it's kind of weird, because to get out of here, she had to walk past oh. Cranny Rags. Now, that's right, my sweet little bird. Come to Granny. Did, would you hurt little girls? Yeah, so there you go. That's the the mono equivalent of uh, of the ability to drink from a fountain. And she's still moonwalking. The handsome one with the beautiful dark eyes. I just want to tell him I'm doing my part. Yes, Granny Rags is doing her part. Tell him, won't you? If you see him, it's good to see you again, dear. But don't dally for that young <laughs> So, like I said, uh, I can't help but get uh, but get a uh, Timmy fell down a well vibe from that. Well, small children should never be placed anywhere within the radius of Granny Rags. Um, <laughs> like the thing about like who's killing like your dudes, I'm pretty sure it's her. Oh yeah. <laughs> the fact there was a rune left in the room where uh, where the dude was killed, and she apparently just happens to have a very large supply of them, sort of leads me to believe that. Is my hair smooth enough? Is your hair is smooth there? enough? Jesus, she's, she's Mary reliving God. a lot. I, I hate this. Look at the, the amazing arc of the incendiary bolt. It's, it's like you really what? got robbed there. Can confirm that's a real problem. <laughs> <laughs> okay, already dead, dude. Mm -hmm. Just making sure because these guys are like megaton jerks. Well, yeah. I mean, to be fair, you've already gotten puked on like freaking four times in in this in this mission. I can understand you make not wanting it to be a fifth. Yeah. So there's really one thing left to do before we go. Although we are obviously not taking Slackjaw's uh, route to uh, to get rid of the Pendletons for us, on, on the account that we have given them a severe case of stabs and drowning. Um, we're going to uh, we're still going to raise the hard place because cash money. Damn straight. I, I can get behind cash money. <laughs> Murder I'm not okay with, but, but burglary? Man, I'm all about that shit. Poor bastard. Stuff can't be worth nothing. 
again, eh? These guys I can get no with. Chance. I think I remember having seen this painting at my grandmother's place. She wasn't a yeah. artist. Yeah. Probably can't even sell it for junk. Not worth taking <laughs> it off the walls. I might go upstairs. See if the mother too found something worth the trouble. Well, as as someone who understands the appreciation of art, I'm sorry, but you feel the have gotta go. The world is better off. Oh my god, I forgot that was a yeah, fatality. That one, that one was not a pleasant way to go either. And we know how much these are worth. 300, 300 coins. 300 gold. That is one of the four Sokolov paintings within this game. That was the self-portrait. I can't help but, no but notice that the floor plan of this place is almost identical to... Um, to... Galvani's, uh, Galvani's house. Mm. I mean, it's just a this way worse repair. This one's a lot more run down, though. Like, I'm gonna venture to the assumption that this was not quite so much his house most of the time. It, like it definitely room. seems more like this was, this was you know, where he ran art galleries and stuff. One more try. They wouldn't have such a strong door unless they kept some interesting thi- I was hoping there would be a grenade involved here. Oh, budge. Not even a bit. And I think I bruised out my shoulder. Stop your crying and give another shove. Just imagine what could be behind it. Look out! Good Damn it! it. <laughs> <laughs> what am I right in the back of the head again? <laughs> there we go. Gorgeous. And uh, that one was a lot more effective. Where the hell did the first one even land? Oh no, they're both they're both there. It's just, I'm just trying to see if I can break these because uh nope. Or it, land, it landed behind that uh, lamp. Wow. So yeah. th there's not really much left of this guy. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, and again, apologies more of me trying to figure out where the hell the combination's been kept because it's like, okay, uh, it's, it's not one, written eight, notes. Three. It shouldn't be in written notes, but I'm trying to figure out, well, where, where, where is it? No? No? It's 183. I do apologize. It's actually under objectives. It's not not in those. It's under objectives under mission clues. There you go. Okay, so I was wrong. One three eight. Whatever. Now I feel like the jerk. Oh, well, there you go. You gotta remember, I've killed a lot of people in the time since, <laughs> since I interrogated him. So it's really hard to keep track of all the bodies. So this place doesn't look like crap. No, and this place has got a lot of fancy stuff in it, including a uh, another circle of painting. This time of the. Uh, of the, well, of the Pendletons. And I love the title for this painting, so I held on it. Curtis Morgan and the Postulate Child. No, notably, notably the Pendleton that we deal with. And Boil Party Invitation. That won't come into play for a while. But, uh, how's now? Yeah, the the, pay, the payoff for that is nice. I always act, I always li I liked it that, that they included that there. There's his invitation to the reopening of the Golden Cat, and that's why it looks so damn fancy. I don't really give it a good look at it, but that's a portrait of Dowd. Good lord. I think there's actually only three circle of paintings here. I don't know why I said four. I think I was counting the one from uh, from the office of... Uh, yeah, you were probably just cut, uh, counting all the ones in the mission. <laughs> I don't know, that seems like a really awkward way to land on some stairs. I mean, I suppose it depends on how on how your legs are, but uh, I'm I'm not hopeful. The I was gonna say it earlier, but the first person mantling animation really bothers me too. <laughs> like okay. you just kind of everybody see yourself. everybody see in there. There was nothing in there. What? Holy <laughs> God! <laughs> I'm just like. That's a lot of rats! Yeah. And I couldn't even see them. And there's this fucker who's like, hey, how'd you like a jaw? Oh. <laughs> it's funny. See, <laughs> the timing on that was perfect. This fucking Bucktooth, Bucktooth jerkwad looking at you. Oh, man. I think he's so fucking funny. Okay, that's that's the way out if you want to avoid walking out with all the guards who are currently walking around going, Who oh, the fuck murdered this guy and stuffed him in a hedge? <laughs> yeah, fuck you You've guys. got a public service to do before you before you do anything else though, apparently. Oh there's there is food in that room I need to eat. 
So quite frankly, like <laughs> them, them injuring me is only going to uh, is only going to encourage me to forge on. Oh, money! Oh, you know, 30, 30 coin, another key to everything. That'll get us out of the place anyway. Gore. Okay, great. Yeah, and with that, that's that is pretty much everything we have to do in the in this particular mission. All we have to do is make our way down to the boat now. It's another case Just of, you know what, we did so much in the mission, you know, but the exfiltration is still full of stuff to do. I, I love how you're <laughs> just strolling. How's it going? Just want to make sure he doesn't have anything extra. Looking for something special? I hate it when games sort of do that. They they spring things like that on you, so I just wanted to make sure. <laughs> okay, we're good. Just make sure you're paying attention. There's an achievement for accepting Slackjaw's deal, raiding the safe and then going telling him the combination. <laughs> I may or may not be doing that in my run. <laughs> See you less of Baldwin. Uh, yeah, that's where Samuel and Emily are. Attention Dunwall citizens. There's no one here to listen to your announcement, buddy. Oh, except this drowner. Weeper. Weeper. I don't know why I call him drowner. You're playing, <laughs> you're playing too much Witcher, man. Yeah, so, uh, oh hey. Lady Weeper. Oh my God! You're, you're, you're doing this. This is happening. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even. Even I can't like make an excuse for my behavior there are at this point. A number of things that I even, and this is not one of them. Well, let well let me talk to him. Well, let me talk to him. I'm carrying a dead just body. Drop so it. Yeah, just us. drop it on his face. <laughs> And he's dead. He's just like you, fucker. Oh, you fucker. Corvo Atana, you son of a bitch. So, something just snapped in Corvo this vision quite clearly. Oh my god, I was not expecting expecting Samuel to knock it out of the park by just shaking his head at you in complete disapproval. <laughs> he's here. Oh He's my the conscience god. of the game, and that is to say that he <laughs> abandons us at the beginning and then meets us at the end. Oh my god. <laughs> that, so, was that was how a that was how a high chaos run of uh, of the golden cat goes. Uh, especially <laughs> especially if you accidentally uh, alert everybody to start with. <laughs> the th the thing I pre I appreciate is is just you know I mean the incredible te a tenor of ass screw I don't have fun with this <laughs> just like I, I I might I might okay I've got an idea of how I'm going to uh, going to approach this oh wait everything just ah fuck it. <laughs> just fuck it <laughs> yeah high chaos high chaos is essentially demands that you leave some bodies behind so I've left a lot of bodies behind this mission the fucking bucket I, uh, is large and in charge is uh. It is. It is really what it is really what they all had coming. So. Oh my god! <laughs> I haven't laughed that uh, that hard in a long time. <laughs> I've, I've just been. Yeah. I realize at the end of the particular video of this we were recording, I haven't left the uh, I haven't left the, the the ending screen on. I just want to say zero alarms again. <laughs> and zero alarms because there was no there was nobody alive to raise them. <laughs> yes, exactly. I suppose that's one way of doing things. Yes, I killed. I killed a very significant number of people as well. So that's. Man, I, 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 I've got, I, I'm not sure how I'm going to top this. I'm going to have to think about this. I'm going to have to, I'm <laughs> have to just... go back to the drawing board. I got to figure out how to top this. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm sure Rov can still find some amusing things to do as well. Hopefully, I haven't done all of them. <laughs> I'm certain you haven't. I mean, even even just screw just screwing around, I found the interaction between overseers and greats. So. You know, I'm sure yes. I can find something. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, well, that's, uh, again, that's the, uh, the high chaos version. Cool guy will be, uh, will be next with the low chaos version to show us how we get through the golden cat nice and quickly. Until then, I've been the last robot guy. I've been cool guy. I've been Orv, and we're now re measuring things in relative mega Hitlers. <laughs> <laughs> We'll see you next time. <laughs> My aim is to reach two. <laughs>